Hey there, Glowforge friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, or Mike Harmon. And yesterday I posted in the forums that I was having troubles. I had been cutting all day, things were groovy. I had a student create a project in Tinkercad. When they exported it, we went to the app and we had a strange behavior. Let me show you what it was. So in the Glowforge app, we simply hit upload and their file was called Box Cameron. And you can see we tried it more than once. When we hit open, we get the lovely little processing and uploading and then after a moment it went blank and we tried and we tried and tried again we had other students that were able to work and this student could not get it to work as a test of the system I opened up one of my old projects and I could see that everything launched just fine I clicked add artwork from this location I did upload again I went back to the other one let's choose the different version still says processing does not give me any information, but it does not show up. It's just not there. So I decided to try and add a piece of artwork from a different project. I went and grabbed the keychain hole that I had made before. I still get these little messages, but this time using something that I had made before, boom, there's my keychain hole, which I'm gonna delete because I don't need. So because I'm not a quitter, I came up with this strategy. I went to Inkscape and I tried File Open and I grabbed that same SVG that my youngster had created. And after a moment's wait, I was greeted by this lovely empty rectangle. So when I take a peek at this file, somehow the rectangle that this student exported is only 100 pixels across. Uh, I have no idea where it's from, but it is not the piece that he had clicked on. And I actually stood there and watched him select it, choose export, make sure it had the selected shape, and then do SVG to save it. And then we always put it in that folder, uh, desktop, empty tools, STL files. I'm going to call this Cameron 3. Even though it is my shape, it is his project. I'm going to return to home and let's give this a quick test to see if everything's back in business. There is Box 3 by Cameron. And this time I still get my little warnings, but hopefully it opens and we're back in business. So my friends, I believe the moral of the story is if you have trouble with the app not working, use another program like Inkscape to load the SVG and see if it really is doing what it's supposed to or if there's errors. So my friends, if you found this useful, please hit the like button. If you got a question, comment, or a suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Mash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit the notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new movie from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.